One of the most exciting series formats to hit YouTube was the Toy Collector series. Coincidentally, happening on two separate channels, that YouTube family and Smelly Belly TV released some great videos about some mysterious nutcrackers that appear at their door, throwing them into a mystery chase surrounding clues. These holiday-themed YouTube series are incredibly thrilling every step of the way to celebrate the inventiveness of that YouTube family and Smelly Belly TV. Let's take a look at some of the top 8 things you didn't know about the Toy Collector series. Howdy Virals! I'm Lady Blah Blah, and if you're new to our channel, please remember to subscribe and put the notifications on so you won't miss any of our cool videos. Number 8. Where are Nutcrackers from? Nutcrackers are an old holiday tradition stemming from the country of Germany in the 17th century. That means it's a tradition almost 400 years old, originating specifically in the Ore Mountains region, settled at the border between Saxony and Bohemia. Number 7. What is geocaching? In the second episode of The Toy Collector, that YouTube family go about geocaching. Geocaching is an online phenomenon in which people hide things for others to find, typically using coordinates as the method of finding them. It is believed that the smash hit Pokemon Go game was heavily inspired by geocaching. Number 6. What is the appeal of geocaching? Geocaching has become a popular pastime for many because of how it forces you to find objects in the real world, often in places where nobody has seen them before. For example, the musician Emperor X once hid tapes via geocaching to promote his album, giving fans the opportunity to go out into the world and find them. Isn't that fun? Number 5. Who is the man on Sally's shirt in Episode 4 of the Smelly Belly TV series? The man on Sally's shirt is Bob Ross. He was a TV host well known for his engaging and fun shows about painting. We highly recommend watching his shows if you're not familiar. You'll definitely learn something about painting and being a good friend to others. Number 4. What is the website that Smelly Belly TV is using in Episode 2? The website is Wikipedia the most famous online encyclopedia, which I'm sure you are familiar with. It's a great place to find tons of cool information you might not know about. But be careful! Your teachers won't appreciate you using it for research on school projects. Number 3. Who was the first person to make nutcrackers? Nutcrackers were originally made by Friedrich Wilhelm Fuchner, and inventor now known as the father of the Nutcracker, talking about some serious long-lasting legacy. Number 2. How were the Nutcrackers spying on that YouTube family? The Nutcrackers had hidden cameras in their eyes that allowed them to spy on that YouTube family in real time without them ever noticing. Talk about a sneaky plan! Number 1. How were the Nutcrackers able to edit the YouTube videos without that YouTube family noticing. The hackers were able to tap into the YouTube videos via something called post data processing, a hacking technique that allows someone to edit the data of a file while it is still uploading. What is your favorite moment in the Toy Collector series and why? Would you like to see a new season of the show? Let us know in the comments below. I'm Lady Blah Blah. As always, thanks for watching, and don't forget to put a like, subscribe, and share this video with all your contacts that love Smelly Belly TV and that YouTube family.